Hello, Legion family. Ace here, and as you see, I am uh, inside of our Thunderbird Lounge. Um, I'm on my way to our department convention uh, this morning. It is uh, June 23rd, um, and uh, we're heading down to Oro Valley, and uh, where all roads lead to our uh, Department of Arizona uh, State Convention. Uh, but what makes this one special is when I return on Sunday, matter of fact, when the gavel drops at the end of our convention, I will no longer be uh, your commander. So I wanted to take this opportunity to thank each and every one of you. I wanna thank you for supporting your post over the last two years that I've been commander. Whether it's been volunteering for many of our programs or just coming up here for a cool beverage, which helps us to fund our programs, or maybe you even led an event that helped raise funds for, again, one of our amazing programs that we have here at Post 109. I thank you, each and every one of you, not just Legionnaires, but our partners in the Auxiliary, one of the, uh, the largest program within the American Legion, the Sons of the American Legion, and a group that I consider our ambassadors out in town, the American Legion Rank. And I would be remiss if I did not mention our Combat Zone veterans, a special group of individuals that have special life experiences that come together um, to express and share with each other. I thank you for all that you've done here at our post. As I leave uh, the office uh, after the last two years, uh, there's a lot that I can talk about. Um, I can talk about how we uh, got our parking lot squared away. Uh, over the last year. And when I say we, I'm talking about our amazing e-board that came together over the last two years and got a lot of great stuff done. We hit 100% membership for the last two years. Uh, we got our roof fixed, a brand new roof uh, done at the post. We have an amazing uh, fence out there, a gate out there uh, that was uh, brought together by a group of amazing volunteers after one of our community members donated $5,000 to our organization. We sent two young men to Boy State this year, young men from right here in our community. And oh, I can't forget about our oratorical contest, our very first oratorical contest that we took part in, where a young lady from one of our local schools uh, made it three levels before she was uh, uh, did not uh, go any further, but she did a great job representing Post 109. We did so many great things over the last two years, um, and I appreciate your support. Now, as we transition, um, I will be moving on to uh, the office of, I'll still be a part of the e-board, but I'll be the e on the e-board as the past commander. And my main job is to continue to mentor and to continue and be an advisor to the commander. And I plan to do that. Uh, I believe that Andre is the next person for the job. And you did a great job, Post 109, voting for him and getting him in office. One of my major projects uh, when I came into office is to revitalize our programs and the things that make Legionnaires Legionnaires. I have a hashtag that I share with my pictures that says, hashtag, this is Legion. Because I never want anybody to think that we're just a chain of bars because that's not what we are. We are a nonprofit veterans organization that has many programs that are sponsored and, and, and surround our four pillars, Americanism, youth, national defense, we have so many great programs that, that we do that surrounds those pillars that um, um, that really, oh, and I'm sorry, and veterans and their rehabilitation, that's the fourth pillar. But we have so many programs that surround those pillars that that's what Legion is. But now that we've established that, we need to take this thing a step further and Andre is the right person. We need to modernize this room. We need to make sure that this room is somewhere where when post 9-11 vets come, it's a place they want to hang out. It's a place they want to be a part of. We need to t more modernize our technology, our computers, security system, things like that. We need to fix that old bar area, the place that we call the old bar. And we need to name it something different. And someone had a great idea, but I'm sure it's going to come up in our September uh, first general membership meeting. At least I hope it does. But we need to modernize that space and make that space a premier event center for this area. This is a growing and thriving area. And our community members and our neighbors need a place where they can have their celebrations, their retirements, their birthday parties, their anniversary parties. 
If we modernize that space back there, if we rehab that space back there, that space can be used for that and also bring in a source of income that again, we can use to support our programs. Andre is the man that can help get us to that next level. Again, Legionnaires, I thank you. I appreciate you. And next time I'm here with you, again, I won't be your commander, but as always, I will be your comrade as a fellow Legionnaire. You will still see me around the post, just not as much. I'll be moving forward to become the um, commander of uh, District 2 within, Department of within the Department of Arizona. I'll still be heavily involved in the programs of the American Legion. It's just that my, my vector is a little different in that office. But you'll still see me here around the post. And when you see me, I'm just ace, man. I appreciate you. I love each and every one of you. And I see you are down at the post for God and country.